All right, guys, we're here at La Michoacana. You know there's always room for dessert. It took us about 10 minutes to get here, but let's go. Let's do it, let's, let's go. Let's go! <laughs> the banana sweet kind of realm but all these flavors here it's literally up for grabs let's try something crazy and let's try something like that i would normally get right All right, so it's super luxurious in there and they have so many. LA, LA, run. run. <laughs> it's super huge and luxurious in there. They have so many <laughs> variety to choose. So if you like sweet sweets, they got sweet sweet. If you want, look at those babies. If you want something savory that makes your mouth water, they got that too. But we're here right now just to try this pineapple juice. We got horchata. We got horchatas. <laughs> oh, I need a refill. Like after this, we gotta get a refill. It's good. There's something so creamy about this one. Like not watery. there's not too. It's not watery. Exactly. It's super creamy, which I like. It's sweet, not too sweet. The cinnamon is on point because I've tasted some more chatas. I oh hell no. Don't even. But this one, it's really, really good. It's super creamy. I love that it's so creamy. It reminds me a little bit of like the um, La Taqueria brand or oh, that man. is like creamy. They have real piña. This is like pineapple to the max, man. Wow. Super refreshing. On a day like today, which is getting hot right now in Cali, Los Angeles, perfect. And they say that this is super creamy as well. Mm -hmm, well, mm -hmm. we're gonna try some other things right here, right now. Well, they are gonna try it. They're gonna tell me how it is. Okay, so let's one, try this first. It's a manzana loca. Manzana loca. No. <laughs> yeah, so essentially it's a green apple and it has tamarindo on the outside and it has like tahini on the outside too. There is jicama, <laughs> there is pepino, there's like little pieces of tamarindo in here. There's chamoy and valentina. So you just dig in. And there's peanuts, right? And there's cacahuates, cacahuates too. Cacahuates, mm -hmm. right. They're like cacahuates japoneses. I'm trying this, the jicama. Right here. Oh, this going is, with the apple. Yeah. All right, fine. I, like, this is like another level. Oh my God, she got sauce down here. Look how saucy. Mm -hmm. All right, cheers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've had so many 
like green apples with tamarindo and tahina on the outside. <laughs> She's dying back there. <laughs> it's so esto, esto, so good. Esto no es de Dios. This is like some heavenly made esto stuff. Es una bendición. <laughs> this right here is wicked in mm -hmm. the sense that you get texture from the apple. You get texture from the tamarindo in the back of it. And then you get this mm -hmm. super great savory sauce. It's not spicy at all, even though it's, it's like... Valentina sauce, yeah. Yeah, but it's not like... Oh, I gotta get, you see that I didn't rush to grab the drink, right? So... Yeah. It's so good. Like, who came up with this? I love cucumbers. I, I, Cucumber to me is like... Yeah. It's a must. Better than pickles. <laughs> better than pickles, I'll yeah. tell you. Nice. <laughs> mm. Let me try mm. a, a peanut, though. It was a bomb too. Oh, the double layer. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I think this right here. Mmm. Mmm. And then this is pepino. This is cucumber. This is pepino. Yeah, so you just grab one of these babies and just dig in. Ay, mi madre. This right. kind of looks like spaghetti a little bit. These. Okay, they're okay. called um, like salsa getty or salsa something like that. Yeah, okay. essentially they're just like little strings with All right. some chile on it. It looks like a shot glass that's a cucumber with I like that. some <laughs> good stuff in there. <laughs> Cheers, guys. It looks like it's dying a little bit, but... <laughs> Man. This thing, mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. if the guy that sells the fruit on the corners were to be selling these just like this, oh my God. We go to him, but we're at La Michoacana. Seriously. And I'm appreciating everything they have done and created mm -hmm. in this. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's dying, look. Let me just explain something because this is like the mother <laughs> and the father. You get like, Mm -hmm. This is the adult version. This is the kid version because mm -hmm. she literally took this and just chopped it up much finer here. Exactly. So if you're not into taking a bite out of something like a shot glass, cucumber shot glass, try this one because this is, I like this more. I like the apple more than the cucumber, but the shot glass is better than the apple. So, uh, I don't know. I like them both. I think it just depends yeah, what I'm you're in the mood for. <laughs> yes, because this is refreshing. But la manzana is tart. The apple is tart. It gives you that. Mm -hmm. mm. You guys have to try this. You have the little sweet, the little bitterness from the apple. You guys have the to try this. The saltiness from the, the tamarindo. The crunchiness from the, uh, the cacahuate sapones. I don't know. Like... The Valentina to me is perfect because mm -hmm. no, no pica. No, I'm doesn't. <laughs> Honestly, this is the messy that I like versus the chicken wing messy. Mm -hmm. I, I prefer this messy than chicken wing messy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. You got your piece? Oh, yeah. Alright guys, so oh, I know this looks like a mess, but it, this is like um you know there's a, a design, there's a design to this mess. So we're gonna go with we're gonna just take a bite like this. Alright, she's gonna mm. it's a moy, so fucking sour. <laughs> He's about to run. I swear, mister, he didn't take anything. <laughs> <laughs> so good. It's really sour, though, but a good sour. Oh, Lord. The tamarindo fucking kicks in right I away. I'm gonna fight tamarindos in that one. Oh, Lord. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh. Don't make my mistake. Don't take like five tamarindos in one bite. <laughs> Whoa. All right. If you want to be woken up, this is going to wake you up. There's a little contrast. Chewy, salty, sweet, savory. A little umami taste combined here. But now I'm going to try the apple. I only had some of the... I had too much of, too much of the chamoy. It's very, the it's very intense. Too? The apple is chopped up too. Oh, okay. I know. I think try the apple. apple in there. The apple. Try well, the apple. it has chopped up and it has... No, get the, the fork. One. Get the fork. Let's try this. Man, this thing is juicy. All right, the apple is amazing. Mmm. This is one of the things that you wanna 
take your time, watch a movie, just eat it slowly, enjoy the flavors. Mm. Oh, so tart. You know, my kids, they beat up each other for one of these apples. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that tamarindo too, like, it's not a thick layer. It's, it's just right. It's like mm. a nice little thin layer of tamarindo. But that chow moy though, like, it's overpowering. The apple's amazing. Mm. It has that coating of tamarind, tamarind with chilies. Mm. Great texture, amazing. I love it. All right, bro. All right. Feel like, feel like that's that's calling you? <laughs> on both of us. Let's do it. Man, I don't know, bro. I'm not so much keen on, on, on cucumbers. I'm a, I'm a pickle guy. I like pickles. Said he'll give you a nickel for a pickle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, guys. Cheers. Cucumber shots. Cheers. You heard that? Mm -hmm. Only in LA. Mm. Holy crunch. <laughs> Captain Poop. <laughs> There's so much. How do you guys do this? How you guys? How is it that you guys enjoy this so easily? There's so much chamoy on this it's thing. It's so much, it's so intense. Mm, it's so Way too much. Mm. Bro, bro, this is like... The Valentina, like yeah, it, it has too much. I can't retaste really the pickle. I can, I can taste I just cucumber. I can taste just chamoy, chilies. You gotta it. dump some of it out. It's overwhelming. I don't know, I'm going for a second one. Yo, yo, what happened with the hair though? It had like, oh, here we got. A spaghetti? There's some amazing hair, because I want to get the full experience. They're filming over there. They're filming fast and not furious. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. The hair is good, right? It's like a flavor sensation. You get the freshness, crunchiness of the cucumber. You get some layers of peanuts. It's like a flake layer of the peanut, then it comes that peanut flavor, but all you get is that punch of the shumai, chilies, that sweet, spicy, savory sauce. Hey, very different. This, this is like candy for Central American people. To me, I prefer this one right here. This one is not my favorite. I don't care too much about it. Still good. This right here, I feel like I could eat this with a lot of things, just little by little bites of the apple spoon of the other till they chopped up apple with the chamoy all the other ingredients pretty good i think overall like they're both good but it's just there's way too much chamoy it's hard to enjoy any of the fruit because it's they're just it's so so uh uh chamoy delicious yeah <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's a little bit overpowering it's overpowering like you're the chamoy overpowers a lot of things it. but you know if you're gonna come here yeah you also have to enjoy paletas and your agua frescas. This is just you know, a, a, a little snack that you can have on the side. This is something that Consuelo wanted to try. This is a guava paleta. Try it. I'm gonna try it first, let's see. Before it melts away. Look at it. It's got fruit. Wow, it has like fruit on it for real. Look at that. Que no quieren focar. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Cheers. Try it. <laughs> wow. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. All right. It's the pink wobble with green wobble pieces on top. It is the most wobbly anything I had ever had in my life. Sweet, delicious wobble texture. Wow. All right. No, no. When you come here, so much fun at the locks, you gotta have paleta because they have every flavor you might think of. You even have tequila flavor. I mean, we're not that crazy to, to get tequila flavored right now, but you know, it's there if you want to try. Uh, we got the guava and uh, sway. Yeah, try it. Yeah, try this. All right, so this is my choice just because I, I normally tend to get something like cookies and cream or like, um, you know, just regular sweet stuff. They have this available and never have I tried one, so let's see how this goes. Mmm. You think this is refreshing? Wow! <laughs> Yo! 
Mm, and how's the little... Is that for it? Wow, Here super go. good. You guys gotta come tell them you're kind of deluxe. And literally, don't eat your food in the sun because this kind of things happen. I need to go and try that one. It's pretty good. Oh my God. A good dance that is so fucking delicious excuse my french but oh my god i love that it has like the actual pieces of guayaba in there They're crunchy it's so crunchy it's so different than the popis ice creams the guayaba like the other ones it's like so creamy so sweet it's delicious but this one actually has these big chunks of guayaba it makes you feel like you're actually eating a freaking like, guayaba ice cream it's so fucking delicious Emotional Remember to like and subscribe guys. Check us out on the next one. We're gonna be here eating up LA. And thank you again to Meal Pilots. Guys, remember to like, subscribe, and also follow Meal Pilots. Yes, sir. We're gonna put the link down <laughs> below in the in the description. They got some good, good recommendations in LA, guys. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm.